Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Major Cliche Plays Castlevania Lords of Shadow. So, so yeah. Pan comes again with words of wisdom and advice for our hero. Gabriel is angry now. Carmilla's betrayal has made him question his own faith. The Brotherhood means nothing to him anymore. He only wants his Marie back. He now has two pieces of the mask and only one more to find to make it complete. He must travel now to the land of the dead, and he must face the final lord, death himself. There are still many leagues to travel, and I cannot risk being seen, for I doubt even one of his brotherhood could help him now. He must go where none may follow, into the abyss. All right, so 1,000%. Uh, yeah, Gabriel is a... Uh... Yeah, checked it out. Gabriel is uh, Rumpelstiltskin. Which is freaking awesome, and I wish I had known that earlier. There would have been so many more jokes I could have made. So now we get to go, and I wonder if we're gonna find the Necronomicon. That'd be that'd be freaking awesome. So uh, we got a, we're gonna have like a lot of skeleton people to fight here, I assume. I'm feeling ripped. Carmilla, being one of the founders of the Brotherhood, received th these magic shoulders as a gift from the Order for her devotion and purity of spirit. Crafted with the feathers of an archangel, originally the Seraph shoulders allowed the wearer to fly short distances, but now, after centuries of misuse by the corrupted vampire Dark Lord, only a fraction of their true power remains. Press jump twice. Yeah, we got a double jump! We have a double jump now! Awesome. So are we going to find members? Yep. Brotherhood. How the hell did you get here? Shadow magic gem. One more away from leveling that up. Sweet. Got to find more life gems. Want to make sure we get all the life. All right. So uh, it's back button, not start. Skills. Relic powers. What crazy flying things can we get now? Whirlwind flap. Upward guillotine. Hey, hey. Wah! So we could totally buy that. We could hold off and try and get ultimate shadow. Which, it costs a lot. So I'm assuming it's going to be ridiculously strong. So I kind of want to hold off on that. Holy Cross was amazing. That worked fantastically. Exploding Quake. Boom. And then just keep hitting it. Okay. So we still haven't used that one, but the Holy Light, that worked amazing for us. So I wonder if that's going to work against all of the shadows, giving the Holy Light. All right, we're climbing. Up oh, we go. Huzzah! Your wings can help you jump further and higher. Wait a minute. What do we got down here? Yeah. Oh ho. Hi, Nilbox. Well, you know, you're not Nilbox. You're just goofy. And we can just kill you quickly. So let's just... Yeah, we're just gonna ice you guys fast. Because I want to see what our buddy down here has for me. Come on. Are you guys just gonna keep respawning? You're just gonna keep respawning. I don't really see a point. Okay, no, you're not respawning. Scroll. It is said that a witch haunts these parts, so I must be on my guard. I have come across terrible creatures and faced incalculable challenges along the way, but I have found strength in God through this adversity. I have developed considerable skills with weaponry, and a command over light shadow magic has proven useful. 
I feel I am strong enough to challenge anything now, and few creatures could take me in one-on-one -on -one combat. Let the Lord of Dead fear. And then he just abruptly died. <laughs> Alright, so... Okay, so we have to do that double jump over there. But we did get the scroll, which is good. Because that was a thing. Wah! Oh, that's how we made the whole jump. Sweet. People are burning in cages. That's not very pleasant. A deal is a deal, dearie. Zombies! What the frick? Oh, what the hell? Get off me. Come on, let go. Alright, you guys are going to be extremely annoying. Especially if every five seconds I'm having to deal with a kill animation. Here, no. How do you guys- you guys regrow your frickin' heads? Quickly, kick him up. Smack him down. All right, you guys are definitely going to be annoying. Cuz I figured that would that would kill you guys as well. Kill you. Kill you. All right, we got to start using our health. Healing powers. Ow. I don't appreciate that. Get over here! Okay. We are in trouble. Those are not... Those are nasty fights to have to deal with. Is there anything down here? No, just death. Okay. I gotta look for them secrets. Them secrets are gonna be somewhere. Hi, dead friend. What note do you have? Oh, god damn chupacabra. Chupacabras wander these parts. I uh, must warn the brotherhood. These pesky creatures do nothing but steal relics and play stupid games. We have more important things to do than partake in trite games. We have to save the world from the Lords of Shadow. The dead walk the earth, and the land suffers. I suggest we kill the chupacabras once and for all, and wipe their existence from the face of this world. This will be God's work, and it is God who commands us. Kill the scum. Great, so he's just gonna show up and steal my crap. Which means I should definitely be healing now. As much as I can. Off the little gobbledygooks. Uh, what? No, can't charge through it. So, what... What am I supposed to do? Yeah, obviously, there's more back here. And I can't jump over it. What? How do... How do I do the thing? How do I get past you? 
I need to know. Uh, we're gonna Hadouken? No. Punch the ground. No. It's not gonna be a regular charge through it. Um, is there really nothing else up here? I feel like I should totally be able to go down there, but I can't. Oh. So apparently there was nothing over there. Okay. I would like to drop down into that cave. I think. Haha. -ha. Wait, now I'm wondering if there's stuff up there. I don't want to miss out on things. I need them. I need the level ups. So... Okay. Nice. Smack your butt. Oh, he's not going to smack his butt this time? I hate you so much, Chupacabra. Hi, dead friend. You have a thing for me, don't you? Life. Oh, sweet. Oh, sweet. Nice, nice, nice. Grow that health bar. And now that we have the angel wings... Yes. Oh! Hello! Nope! Okay, well, at least now I know how I get through those rocks. Chili! Chili! Chili Willy! Okay, I get it. We are not close. You're gonna be my pet. It's gonna be okay. We're gonna be friends. I'm gonna name you Lumpy. Yes, yes! Yeah, bitch slap them all. Come on, kill him. Drop down, come on. No! Actually wasn't too annoying with the chupacabra. And now that gave us a passage back this way, right? Because this is the cave we were in before. Correct? Correct. It's alright, it's alright. I can run really fast, but only for a short distance. Down we go. And down we go. All right, so now I, whoa, no, don't do that. All right, let's actually go back because I want to see if there was anything up that path the other way. 
Sprint. There we go. Double tap. Wah! Wait, was there stuff back here to recharge? Mm, probably, but further back than I want to go. Up. What do we got up this way? Tiki men. Excellent. Yeah, we're just going to take you zombies out as fast as humanly possible. Get him. There we go. Uh oh. Still got more heads. Okay. Alright, they actually don't take all that much to kill if you attack their bodies right away. Okay, so that's very good to know. What do you got for me? Yes! Shadow power increased! Yay. Now you're at the same level as the light magic. Totally worth. And in we go. Could go around the other way, but this was actually kind of fun to do. And up we go. All right. What? I have... I can fly? I'm Peter Pan? Okay, apparently we gotta do it a lot sooner. You overjumped it. You bastard. It's because you saw the ledge, so you went to make it. Okay. Across we go. You seem like you're going to fall and trap me on this side. Definitely need more health, though. Sprint. You did not sprint. Son of a biscuit. Oh, that hurt a lot. No, stop camera angle. Sprint. Jump. Hook. Grab. Up so daisy. And across this way. Because for some odd reason, the land of the dead, it's just all dirt. That's, that's how we denote dead things. They're just in the ground. It's a thing that they do. I feel like I could go that way, but if I go that way right now and I'm wrong, I'm dead. So let's not do that. What do you got for me? Paper? I've seen him. Gandolfi lives. He hides in the forest in the guise of an old beggar. I'm sure it is him. He is the warrior we have been hoping for. He will take down the Lords of Shadow with his legendary weapon and save us all. I knew he would return. Praise be to God. Ooh, are we going to get, like, another weapon upgrade from him? Because that would be kind of cool. That, that'd be, that'd actually be kind of cool if we run into Gandalfini. James Gandalfini. So there was a light magic gem somewhere in there that we missed. That'll happen. All right. Woes more. The stench of death is strong. A witch holds power here, but I sense Gabriel is more than a match for her. The bones of his fellow warriors litter the place, but he seems oblivious to them. Stoic and determined to move forward, he doggedly fights on. He has not slept for days. He rests only briefly. 
I sometimes hear him talking to her, telling her he loves her, that they will be together again. In the dark, he weeps for her, or perhaps it is for his own lost soul. Is he, like, rubbing his nipples as he reads this? Jesus. I mean, there's a lot more voice acting from Patrick Stewart in this game than there is from Gabriel. Yeah. That was totally alive at one point, or I think. It's got... Like, this is just weird. Okay. Going up to a house in a basket. Nothing wrong with that. It's perfectly natural. Avon calling. Lost your way. Oh, lost your way. Master told Baba you would come. Who is your master? The king, of course. The king of the angels. Want to see my wings? Last your way, then. <laughs> Baba can help. Baba knows the path. Where is it? Where must I go? Only in the music box can blue rose grow. Baba wants to be young and pretty again. Bring Baba blue rose. Baba will show you the way to the land of the dead. Baba shrink you small enough to enter the box. <laughs> Inside you must pass the test and bring Baba Rose back. <laughs> Baba who will be young again. Oh, oh yes. Baba. Box locked. Scarecrows took keys. Oh, bad scarecrows. Keys of three. Bring me three, and you will see. Baba glad to set you free. Find keys and bring to Baba. B Baba not lie to you. Three keys. Go no further without the keys. I will get them for you, but you must promise to help me. Yes, yes, promise I will. Keys first. Go, go. Okay, Baba? You are like the trash lady from Labyrinth. Like the hoarder lady. I forget what she was called. She was just surrounded in garbage and had garbage covering her. You've unlocked a main character entry. Baba Yaga. This old hag is the subject of many a myth and popular folklore. Mostly appearing as an evil witch who eats children and lives in a cabin that stands on a pair of chicken legs. While parts of these legends are true, her house does not stand on chicken legs. Though as for the rest, who knows? Baba Yaga likes to brew a special tea made from extremely rare blue rose petals, which temporarily transform this hideous old hag into a beautiful young woman. Although she will sometimes help people, it is usually very dangerous to ask her for a favor, unless you are very polite and can offer her something in return. Well, apparently we're gonna get, uh... There yes, Laura, the childlike empress. The deceptive, ruthless killer murders hundreds of innocents over many centuries because they're blood craving, uh, particularly cruel, and blah, 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 blah. Oh, Vincent Doran. Oh, yes. I thought we had already read yours and gotten you out of the way. Monsters. Headless Burrower. Lots of things mess you up except for fairies. <clears throat> or, I don't Maybe the shields mean it's like defensive for me and the skulls mean it's an attack? I, I'm i still not really sure how we're supposed to be reading that. Ah, Mila. Oh, yes. Holy water is the only thing that was good against her. We didn't bother looking at that. Can we have more locks? Deadly Toys. I just want all the exclamation points to just go away. Yeah, go away. Go away. Ghouls. Yeah, the witch child was fun. Alright. We gotta get keys from a scarecrow. Just, uh, 
at a scarecrow. Flock of crows has arrived. Oh, hello, dead friend. What do you got for me? Scroll. Which said the scarecrows bonded to these posts were alive, and at first I didn't believe her. But now, after days of watching over one of them, I am not sure what to believe. Yesterday, a couple of birds landed on the scarecrow's head, and I could swear I saw the thing move to catch them. Immediately, I grabbed my sword and attacked the monster, but it remained inert without responding to my blows. Okay. Puzzle time. Then this seems a what? Oh, hand breaks. You do not get to suck my health. I don't have that much. Oh god. Oh. Quickly grab it. We gotta shake it. Shake it. Shake it. Shake it. Ah, you must be alive. Oh, hello. You seem like you're a pleasant fellow. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that would scare the crows. Holy crap, you're fast. I hit all. See, what I hate is you're not going to tell me what your weakness is until after I kill you. I rolled. Almost dead. Okay, so you can make spikes come up from the ground. Smash the bee button. There's a key. Yes, okay, he dropped a key. Let me suck up the orbs, grab the key. Alright. Bestiary. What do you got for me? What, what are you actually weak against? Ah, holy water, just regular holy water, and the dark crystal. Well, all right. All right, shaky, shaky, shaky. I don't, under, why would I need help with this puzzle? Okay, there's another, a new flock of crows. Oh. Okay. How do I get up to you? No, 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 Mandrakes. Alright, well, I'm just gonna keep shaky, 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 you guys. Where are you going now? Right back over to that one. So, I'm assuming I want to move you guys onto that one that's over there. Because when I do find my way up there, then the other crows won't be able to land on that one, maybe? That's where we're going with this, I think. Who knows? Because I gotta leave the crows over here. Just, yeah, get the health up. Saw through the wood. There we go. Yeah, I'm assuming we had to get them to move. Those other crows. We got a dead friend. Now you're going down there. Okay. This puzzle might take a bit. Light magic. 
Delightful. I really could have used that. So that was good. No, no, no. You do not get to suck me. Take out the little man breaks. What are you? Holy water. Totally want you. Give me the holy water. Oh, I didn't even realize there was a little mandrake guy there. He's trying to grab the wheel. Okay, just grab the wheel. Shaky, shaky, shaky. Oh, okay, so I can't have them on the same posts. Okay. Sure, why not? Go over there. And now you can come back over here. Shaky, shaky, shaky. So now you're going to go to this post, and now if I shake it again, you're going to go to the right. Yeah, you don't like that one because those guys are there. So now you're over here. And now this will lead you to the next scarecrow, right? Yes. I really hate crows. It's all Jon Snow's fault. Oh, damn. You are horrific. How? Everything I do, I do it for you. Roast you down with a holy light. Smash you, smash you, smash you. Next key. Let's go. Yes, okay, yeah, I can see that he dropped a key. Delightful. So now are more crows going to show up? Do I shake it with the crows flew somewhere else okay oh hi dead friend what do you have for me scroll this land was once teeming with life and beauty now look at it the stench of death is everywhere the scarecrows see everything and i have heard that the crows of malphus watch over this place and report back to their mistress an old legend is written that the witch killed the lover of Malphus, and that she swore revenge on her. I wonder if the old crow still lives, or if it's just another scary bedtime story for children. Okay, we gotta get the crows to fly over to that. So I'm assuming I gotta lead these crows over here? On. Shaky, shaky. Alright, so I got you guys over here. Do I have to try and move you to that one? Are there more crows this way? Ooh. I won't break you down. What do you got for me? Another set of crows, okay. Alright, what do you got for me? Light magic. Okay, 
shaky shaky on you. Yeah, you should totally be going there. Uh, anything else down here? Ooh. Yes. I thought you were just a random fire. I didn't realize you were a statue. So, shake you to get you to move up to the other one? Yes. Get all the holy water. And then if I shake you, you'll go to Scarecrow Man? No, we can't go here. So you just fly back. Damn it. Okay. Alright, shaky you guys over here. I would have had to use the new crows. Because it seems like the old crows would know, oh, if we're going to do that thing, it's going to scare the crap out of me. Where are you going to go? So you're going to go to the one that's further back now. So now I shake you guys onto that one. And then I'll shaky these guys onto that one so you don't you can't backtrack. And now you new crows have to fly into Scarecrow Man. Yeah. Yep, there we go. Ah. All right, so that took out a nice chunk of his health. Okay, wait. Ah, oh, god damn it. How do I? What is the? What is the shadow one again? I never remember because I never freaking use it. Exploding Quake. X and then hold Y. X, hold Y. Oh, that, that did quite a lot. That was delightful. I really, really need to use those powers more. But I also gotta get better at not... Not screwing up combos, so that I can use them more. Baba Yaga! We got stuff and things for you. So I'm assuming uh, this is going to complete this part of the mission, and then we'll be inside the tiny box in the next one, right? I have no idea where I'm going. Hi, Mandrake. Leave me alone. You don't get to suck the life from me. Ugh. Yay, we went the right way. Let me up. Whee! I don't know. I really feel like that rock has got a way more. This should be a much faster elevator. But at least it's not a ladder. And I don't have to climb to get up there. So, there is that. What's up, Baba Yaga? 
Good. <laughs> Good. Oh. Now, Baba, put you inside the box. What? Close your eyes, or spell will blind you. Septum contra bestias fabuli! All right, and that's going to do it for this episode, guys. Uh, we missed out on a life gem and a shadow gem. Uh, all right, guys, well, that's going to do it for this episode. Leave a like if you like the video. Comments in the section down below. Subscribe if you're not already subscribed. Follow me on Twitter, and I will see you guys in the next episode.